Hi, my name is Chibet and I'm a visual artist based in Kenya, currently focused on photography and GIF art. I am also exploring different art forms like painting and sometimes sketching, but like only when inspiration hits, and film. Fakugezi was something very unexpected for me, like I nothing could have been said to me to prepare me for the amazingness and awesomeness that I saw while I was there. I ended up doing this um, two-day um, workshop with the SDNA team who are, I will leave a link, but they are a, a team who does life projections on buildings, they've done a few in forests, they've done a whole 360 degree thing, It's they've done some really crazy stuff. So I got the opportunity to work with them on um, these live projections that they were supposed to do, we were so we were we ended up doing at the Alight Festival, and they helped me conquer my fear of after effects. It doesn't sound like a real fear, I know, but to me it was it's been a serious struggle to use after effects. But I ended up doing it, and I ended up conquering that fear. And um, basically, those three days taught me so much. It opened my mind up to new possibilities in terms of my art and new avenues to express myself and new avenues to exhibit like if, to do installations to do a lot of cool stuff with a lot of different forms of media which was um is definitely one of the biggest lessons i think i learned during this during that time at the Papu Gezi festival was just to open my mind up to keep going to keep evolving highlights of my trip and cool people i met um i met this really dope graphic designer called cindy sonyoni who is Zimbabwean but based in Johannesburg. He's super cool and he taught me the importance of contracts and formalities. Um, who else? Uh, Shoni. Shoni took me around. He's one who um, gave me the opportunity to meet all these dope people. Um, uh, so Shoni was really cool. He is the one who told me that you have to keep staying one step ahead of yourself and others. I liked Another highlight of my uh, experience at the Fakugezi Festival was meeting the residents, um, the CS residents, and seeing their exhibition, Mambokadzi. It was something extraordinary. That is what I can say, extraordinary. They used, it was a mixed media slash technology meets art slash. Like, it was just really dope. Another highlight of my trip was um, the visit to the Nelson Mandela Museum. Um, I met this lovely lady called Madonna who I photographed. Um, she wasn't, she stood out because she wasn't necessarily like, she wasn't part of, you know, us tourists so I just going in to see where Nelson stayed and stuff like that. No, she was on the outside and she wasn't one of the tour guides because I didn't see her taking anyone around but she was just, you know, standing there and I, I you know, I approached her and asked her as a photographer and she she agreed, she obliged and she I took a picture of her and then she asked me where I was from and I told her I was from Kenya and she immediately I told her that she was like there's a painting in the house, did you see the painting in the house of Nelson that was done by a Kenyan artist and I was like no I haven't seen it so she took me into the house and she showed me this painting and she started speaking about it and speaking about how she like the artist captured, truly captured Nelson Mandela um, in a way that she hasn't seen anyone else capture him. In all, my Fakugezi festival experience was wonderful um, and so amazing and so beautiful and so, um, what other adjective can I use? Um, so phenomenal and so eye-opening and mind-blowing. It was just all those things wrapped in one. And I loved learning new things every day. I loved experiencing new people every day. I loved experiencing a different culture. It was, it was so fantastic. And I'm so grateful to Chep Chumba of Digital Africa for nominating me, and the British Council, and Sandra Chenye. It basically allowed me the opportunity to experience these new people and these different cultures and to get opportunities to collaborate and meet amazing friends and contacts. Definitely looking forward to collaborating with some of the people that I met and working with them in the future.